Hi everyone and welcome and Larry thank you so much for the nice introduction and just a shout out to all you folks that are joining us and I like to shout out to I see Gary I see Lon so thank you so much for joining and I'm looking forward to spending this next hour together so before I get into product I just want to tell you a little bit about spring step men's because now we're getting into can you believe it spring of 2022 and spring step men's what does it represent well first and foremost I'm going to say classic cool comfort and of course high quality styles and you're going to be really um, I hope surprised by seeing um, an expansion to our real life collection for men so stay tuned we have that coming up for you before I get into product what we always like to do is to share our best selling styles with you and if you've been with me before on presentations you know that you know I always explain that we're very data driven we look at multiple different key indicators and one of which is re orders we watch that because number one we want to make sure we're open stock and in stock for when you need it but also we watch that reorder because for us that means it's registering so let's get into it so you can see on your screen and please follow along and just one last comment too to make it really easy if you see something that you like you can always just take your camera and snap a picture of the screen so let's get started to the best sellers so first and foremost it's number one which is Lugano number Number two is Matteo. You'll see some updates to Matteo. Number three is Niccolo. Number four is Jared. Five is Abisco. Six is Cito. Seven is Lawrence. Eight is Matt. Nine is Darrow. And ten is Edvard. So that's our best selling styles. And you're going to see as I go through the presentation where we have updated and enhanced those styles to be, of course, cool cool comfortable and classic so we're going to get right into the styling so let's get started in our first style is Lugano and as you can see Lugano is ranked as number one and you can see why so as we start this whole collection I'm breaking this up by categories for you so this is our active category and I hope you can see why so let's get started with Lugano you can see that he is active inspired he is leather and the great thing here and I do point this out I want you to take notice um, of course of the high quality but of that burnishing look at the brown it just looks so great so rich and when we say active you know he wants to be easy he wants to have comfort but he also wants to make sure he can just get in and go of course you have your twin gore right here we always like to put padding where we can especially on the heel where there's a pressure point and then I'm going to show you the back check out the little detail here to make him active and it's really about this outsole so just take a look at how cool it is it has that navy it has that off-white look and again it's that flexibility you can see why Lugano is number one and of course it is a black it's this really nice navy and then it's this cognac color so that style Lugano so please take notice so our next style within the active category is Tommy and again looking cool being comfortable because that's what it's all about and check out Tommy so again you know it's really kind of an inspiration from an athletic style but what we did here and I hope you can see this outsole it has shades of gray so it goes from a lighter gray down to a little bit of the darker gray and then of course you can see your bottom which is your darker color I just want to point out about all the high quality materials that we do use this has a little bit of the pebbled um, finish to it the high grain a uh, high high grain leather and you can see that burnishing and of course we're going to give him some nice laces and then it's just a really cool nice style so that's style Tommy our next style within our active collection is Gambino and talk about ease talk about active super lightweight I wish you can feel how lightweight he really is and take a look at that look at that flexibility so that's what's going to give you that comfort and then again it's really you know we talk about class active it's classics but just with that ever so slightly modern details and the details I'm talking about is this piping all around here a little bit of the 
the padding just to elevate the look a little bit. Love that outsole, love what it represents. And of course, you can see I talk about that great burnishing, especially in the black and the browns. Our next style here within the collection is Daniello. And here, take a look at him. What's so special about him is that we, of course, want to make sure that the style looks great on the outside, but check out the inside. So again, you have that really nice active look with the way the lining is, and of course that insole, and look at the upper. So what this is, is this is actually a woven upper, and just how classic and cool it is. Of course, you have your double gore right here, and then it's that active look here with that outsole. I'm gonna go to an image now, because I want you to see the black. Look at how smart looking that black looks. So you have that white outsole, and of course, just that really nice black rich upper and that's our style Daniello. So my next style staying within active is Michael and again check him out. So I talked about the wovens. Yes it's always it's always classic for us. In here we have a little bit of that woven look right here in the middle of the shoe and the toe character. Very classic. You can kind of see my uh, hands following it and check out the outsole. This is what makes him so cool, right? So he's black and of course that little bit of that two-tone where that upper material is right around that toe shape. And of course I always talk about, you know, we talk about comfort. Yes, of course it's padded in the tongue, but also right here, these laces here, they're elasticized with that little cool toggle. So of course that really brings in a nice, of course a design element, but also a comfort feature. So that is Style Michael, and this is the black. I'm gonna go to the next category, and our next category is leisure, because at the end of the day, everything is about ease and leisure, and this is made in Turkey. This is Mateo. Mateo is ranked number two, and I just wanna spend a moment just to explain the construction. Um, you may see the reminiscent, or the um, inspiration is from our Fusaro construction in our Spring Step Women's. So this is a stitch construction. It's made in Turkey, and that's what giving it all that great flexibility, that great look. This is a Nubuck leather. So Nubuck leather is super duper high quality, really, really soft. It has pin dot um, perforations here. It is lined, so the pin dots don't go all the way through, but take a look, and I, you know, I always just kind of boast a little bit about this navy. Take a look at the navy, and just to add another little element to the detail, even the stitching from this upper directly to this outsole is a navy color. I do want you to see the outsole so you can see what it looks like. Of course, right here, you have right here for your shock absorbing for your heel, and of course, he is ranked number two. I'm sure you can see why. Beautiful fall, nice colors, four of them. It's an annual style. And the next style, here's the update. Here's the inspiration. This is style Whip. Whip is new. He is made in Turkey. It's that same exact construction that I just explained. But check this out. So style Whip is a smooth leather. I'm gonna show you all the colors here, but check out this removable insole. So number one, you can see, can you see this terrific heel cup right here? That's gonna hold your heel. That's gonna give you the confidence. That's gonna give you all that ease right where you need it. So you stand up straight. And you can see all that nice leather here. And of course, look at the rich color. So unlike, the previous style that I was just showing you, that is a new buck. This is a nice smooth leather. And again, here's a really nice navy. We're introducing a gray with the black outsole. I think he looks really smart. A black and of course that really nice brown. So this is something new for 2020, expanding upon that success. So there you go, that's a nice new style. This next style is Sito, ranked number six. I'm sure you can see why. So within this leisure category, you can see he's gonna just really be nice and easy. A pebbled finished leather, and again, just a very classic style, but I want just to show you the outsole. Number one, just take a look at the shape, very classic, very clean, almost has that sleek look to me. And then right here in the back, you can see, just comes up ever so slightly, almost like a driver moccasin and there you go just a very nice easy black and a brown ranked number six my next style within this leisure, and I hope you're all feeling leisurely, is Dover. So we talk about moccasins. This is more of a traditional driving moccasin. So I'm gonna show you the bottom so you can see what it looks like. And again, these are pebbled leather, and this particular style is made 
um, um, really with a lot of the pebbled material, but what I'm trying to say here, sorry, is that what we have here is this band that goes right around, and this is a suede material. Not only does it protect, but it just, of course, brings that design element. So this is styled Dover. So my next style here is Jared. I'm staying again in that whole collection. And here, just very classic. So now it has a really nice bit here. I want you to see the outsole because it really kind of brings, you know, how you have that traction, that stability, and that comfort. A little bit of the driver that goes right up here. And again, just very easy on, easy off. And that style Jared. And then we have the next style. This next style is exciting. He is new and his name is Crispin. He is made in Turkey. And I hope you can see the, you know, of course it's the high quality leathers. You know, Turkey is really known for their high quality leathers. And of course the, the tanning and the way that they, um, that they produce the leathers, you can see that burnishing here. Here you can see perforations. The perps do go all the way through. It is lined. I just want to show you that it is lined although the perfs go all the way through and then of course the perfs are on the side for that really nice relaxed leisurely feeling and of course there is your black there's your brown and I just want you to see that back of the outsole and that is style Crispin and I want to just tell you about the next one made in Turkey of course Lusano Lusano and he was in our top rankings and here again just a really rich and I'm going to use that word rich because number one I love how this navy came out of course this um, more this lighter brown and the dark brown very rich when you see it's a combination of leather and suede and I hope you can see here on the camera maybe I show you the light one I want you to see that it does have that pattern of that like that croco look and again it's bringing in that richness and one last feature about him is you can see leather right here covered around that that nice little bit which is like kind of a rope look so really kind of cool as you can see the way I'm going through these styles there's so many details that are put into men's styles and I have to kind of say one quick thing about men something that I have noticed of course with my husband as well is that there are men out there who have closets as large as ladies with their shoes in there. So I know they want to be cool and fashionable. Getting into our next category and that's street style. These are street styles. These are really fun, easy, lightweight. And this style, his name is Chris. He's a repeat. So we did introduce him in the fall. We're going to continue him in the spring. And a lot of these styles you'll see are going to be annual because they are seasonless. I wish you can see and feel with me how lightweight these truly are so look at that it's so lightweight I love the outsole I'm gonna show you the bottom so you can see that really cool look they have um this really nice neoprene all the way around so of course it's giving that ease I always talk about the elasticized uh, laces and of course that toggle excuse me for one moment I had to take a sip and of course you have the really cool <clears throat> street style elements which is really bringing in that 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 red and that blue as far as that little stripe and even on the black we bring it in so I also have something else to tell you about Chris he just came into stock so please go feel free to um, place an order on him okay next style sorry I did have to take a sip there next style again remember we're, we're, we're really into this category of street style made in Turkey new his name is Chaz and check him out so we know really what's fashionable and what's happening out there are these really cool and I'm gonna call them these these translucent cool looking outsoles so what we did is look at how we tied it all together I'm just gonna take a minute you can see that little white stripe right there in the outsole and of course you have your stripes and look at the cool laces a removable insole right here of course you can see all that great cushioning there and i'm just going to kind of turn the style around so you can see the accents it's more like an off-white accent and again i took that i wanted to take that insole out so you can see again one of our signatures is this strobel construction where that's what gives it all that great flexibility and um i think he's really super cool looking and of course he comes in this one color so now he has a brother right because we always want to make sure that they have brothers and this is Wahlberg and look you have that same really cool edgy outsole and here's what we did here we're bringing in the yellow so that yellow ties and I don't have to 
explain it all because I hope you can see it right here on your screen. Check out the two-tone laces bringing in that yellow. I want you to see the lining. It's that really great yellow and trust me, it is not a bright yellow, but it's right on trend with that really cool yellow. And then here's your removable insole and check it out. We put yellow, how cool is that? How great, and you can see all that um, padding there. And not only padding inside, but I also wanna always point out the tongue. The tongue of that style also is padded and all the way around and it really adds that extra comfort. So now you can see why we say street style because that's what it is. And that's another new style. The next style is Trenton and it's new and these are still made in Turkey. So, you know, you know from our other brands, we really, um, we love the quality and the technology that comes from Turkey and this is style Trenton. So again, really lightweight. You can see these great colorations. I'm gonna boast a minute about the gray. I love the way this gray came out. And again, it's leather and you can see it has that suede toe accent. There's your white um, outsole. And of course, we, you know, even when we do this top eyelet, we talk about details, right? When we do the top eyelet, it actually has metal eyelets right around and that's for durability and of course it's for comfort. I always tell you about the padding on the tongue and check it out, you know, just to really bring in, to tie it in the white laces, that white outsole, of course, with that white, really cool lining. So make sure you mark him on your sheet for spring of 2022 going to get into the next category and I hope you're appreciating how we're really bringing it into categories but this category is all about ease so we talk about comfort and ease and really it's easy it's breezy and it's really nice I wanted to show you these these are now made in Italy so you can see we're really kind of going around that globe going into Europe and what makes these so great is and again it's removable you'll see the foam here but when I say ease here this top lining here I'm going to describe it mo uh, like a terry cloth and that really um, is going to bring you that really nice not only comfort but that easy feeling because these are that really cool cloth so when we have that of course you have your twin goring you can see that it's made in Italy because of course we boast about it and it has really that summertime look with that jute that goes right around and you know I talk about the flexibility there you go and really it's the it's you know it's a canvas really the material is a canvas here and you can see that it has that denim look really denim friendly and actually a charcoal color not a true true black but a charcoal color all the edging is piping and again it's all that details all that quality that we bring into it this next style so this name is Lawrence okay oh I'm sorry Hamilton I have one image because I wanted to show you the beige and that's what the beige looks like okay next style is Lawrence so we're still made in Italy because this is one of their um, specialties. And what I really just wanted to kind of show you here is, of course, it's anatomic in this um, in this insole. When I say ease, you can see, I do want you to see, it is a textile. It has a mesh look, so it does breathe. It does have the, I'm going to say, um, the breathability. The, it's not a perforation, but it does um what do I want to say? Just have like, you know, breathable holes right through. And of course, it's two materials. So you have the material that I'm talking about um, of that really cool mesh. And then of course, it almost looks, and it's very soft, it almost looks like kind of that cool burlap look. Easy and look at the, um, the wrapping. And here he has just that little bit of that heel just to give him that little bit of the lift. So this is Lawrence and this is, um, this is something that is a repeat. Next style is Anders. Now, Anders was, was with us in our line and we're going to continue with him. And um, really what's so great about him, again, it's the lightweight. It is that really great fabric textile. And you can see when I talk about ease, ease of getting in and getting out. And there you go. I do want to show you an image of the black. The black, what we did here is we put that black upper, of course, but with that black bottom. And of course, we just left that really coolness of the tan um, ran right around just to give him that little um, fashion element, I will say. 
Okay, so next, we're gonna go into the next category, and this is our business category, because we also know that things are getting back to normal and um, business must be conducted. So this is a style Brando. We're adding a new color here. It is a black, unfortunately. I do not have a sample here, but I just wanna walk you through the style. Here's the coolness of this. So we talk about classics with fashion. So number one, take a look at the burnishing. I want you to see how we do the colorations. So again, inside, and we're all about inside. I want you to see, I hope you can see the really cool lining. It has that men's wear look of that fabric. It, it looks just so, again, so luxurious inside. Really a classic style, because you have that little classic bit of your, um, of your penny loafer. And I want you to take notice of the toe shapes. So as I talk about all of our men's styles, it is with the European sizing. It is with the European lasting. So that's what's going to give you all that great room. Although these are a little more pointy. My Brando gray, I want you to see what the gray looks like. A black will be all over black. But again, that gray has that burnishing look. Okay, let's move to the next, and this is Style Charlie. And I wanted to make sure I pointed out the last to you as far as the European lasting, because as you see with Charlie, yes, he is a little bit more of that, more of that almond-shaped toe, but because we use our European lasting, you will have that room right where you need it, which is really right across that toe area. Really cool, um, I'm gonna say a cool offtake on almost a wing tip, because here you can see right here your perforations very classic it's a really pretty you know I say these these colors are just so so rich and of course you can see the really nice laces that we put on him so he's gonna look fashionable no matter where he is and of course take a look at the inside that lining has that blue lining again just to elevate it to the next level so that is style Charlie my next style is Nico. Again, he was up in the rankings and check out what we did here. Talk about a wing tip. So he's classic looking, but not so classic, right? So this is your navy multi. And take a look at the way we do the colorations, the way we do the, the hand, um, everything is, has that hand burnish to it. And it's really the navy, the camel, the Bordeaux. I point this one out, I guess, because I love it so much. But of course, you'd also have this really nice, rich, brown combination and take a look at the outsoles how we do it we do it like that two-tone color again elevating it bringing it to that next level making him look and feel great inside and out and that's what it's all about because men want to feel great too Okay, our next style in this whole business category is style hickory. And you can see again, it's a little bit of that classic style, but look what we did with this outsole. So unlike the other outsoles where they were more of a stacked heel look, this is a um, this is an EVA material. So what's gonna happen, it's gonna give you extra comfort because number one, it's EVA, it's super light, and of course it looks really kind of cool. I'm gonna just bring this, um, this brown color out. I'm sure you can see the burn Burnishing. And really, I hope you can see, but this is like a navy blue color, the EVA. Really cool. I think it's a really cool twist. And of course, you have your twin goring, easy on, easy off. And again, just take notice of that toe shape. Really professional, really cool. No matter where you look, you're going to look nice and polished. So don't keep them just for the office. My next category is classics. Now, in this next category, yes, we will have a lot of styles coming up because we all are about classics. So let's get started with classics. This is a style, um, he ranks number five, and he is made in Turkey. And again, it's all that high quality leather. You can actually see it and feel it. And I do just wanna take a minute because I want you to see this removable insole. So many of them have it. And take a look at all that cushioning right where you need it. It's at that heel point. You have perforations here for the breathability. And I want you to see all the great materials that we use because that's gonna give you all that really nice comfort. Again, you're padded here behind the collar and you know even as we look even this back it's not just a straight back it has that dip and that's going to bring you nice comfort and nice classic styling my next style is Devon I don't have the sample here so we're gonna go right to an image so you can see it you can see why he's a classic and really you can just take notice of again it's that um the padding around the back and of course that the two twin gores and you have you can just see that really comfortable outsole there okay 
Next is Keiko. Again, Keiko has been with us. He's a classic. And again, it's removable. I just always like to have those kind of shown to you so you can see it. Of course, it's marked in your catalog accordingly. You can follow along. And again, classic. So we talk about what? Slip-ons, lace-ups, but look at this. A classic for us is something that has this really nice, it's, a, it's this Velcro strap, almost this monk strap, nice and wide. Of course, our hook and loop closure is superior because we want to make sure that it stays on the foot. And I just want to take a peek. I just want to take a minute to open so you can see really how great and open it is. So it's easy to get on and off. And then again, just take notice of that really nice, more of that rounded uh, uh, toe shape. And again, that toe box. And take a look at that really great outsole. I like to show you the bottom so you can see how they're how they're sculpted and how they're constructed. So my next style is Style John. Just a very classic name for a classic shoe. So John, you can see he's a little more almond toed. And again, just that nice little twin Vigor uh, right there. And again, he just has a really nice, I want you to see that outsole. Just very um, classic and traditional, very comfortable. And it has that little bit, you know, I don't want to call it a wedge, but yes, that little bit of that wedge to give him that little lift for the Comfort. And of course, you can see right around here that it has that little bit of the um, the front, so it's not like a pitch, like a woman's shoe. But also, I want you to see the back, and so you can see all that designing. I hope you're enjoying all the details as I go through these. My next style, his name is Felix. Again, made in Turkey, so just keep that in mind. Here's these. Um, these removable insoles that I brag about, but we just have a classic, a black and a brown, of course, all leather, leather lined, and really I do, I take notice of the toe shape. So now he's, um, he's a very clean looking toe shape, and you can see just right around here has that really cool edge, um, edging, so it kind of gives it that little bit of that border feeling, if you will. He has that little bit of the dress heel, but again, it is the uh, the TPR, and I just want to show you here for one moment. Do you see here where my finger's pointing? That's an anti-shock area on the heel, and that's going to give you the extra comfort where exactly where you need it, and that's our style Felix. Made in Turkey. Um, the next style is also made in Turkey. This is Berlando. And I point out all these differences because sometimes we look at a men's style and say, wow, they all look alike. But there are different characteristics, whether it's the toe, the burnishing, or just the shapes. So please take notice of this toe shape. Remember the last, so you will have the room where you need it. Here's your twin gore, just as you need it. And of course, we just add some styling elements. I hope you can see it here along the side where it's just the way that we have cut the leather and pieced the leather to add interest. Of course, it's that little bit of that heel, that um, outsole I showed you before, and there you go, right there on your heel for your little shock absorbing right where you need it. My next style here is Style Matte. And here, what you can see, again, classic. So now we have this little bit of that square toe. It's always in style. You may think it comes and goes, but at the end of the day, it's always in style. You will look very stylish wearing this style mat. Here's my removable insole. And really, it's just another classic. It's just a nice lace up. And of course, we know that there are fellas that really like it. Again, it's that really nice, you know, when I see a classic style and a men's style and I can do that, that's something really wow. Ranked number eight, Matt. Okay, we're gonna go to something new, and this is Style Laredo. You'll see on my screen, I'm just missing two colors of samples. It's the black and the dark brown, just so you can get an idea. But I do have this one style, the cognac, here with me, so let me walk you through him. So this is something new, and what we realize here is, again, you have your nice, your hook and loop closure. He has a little bit of the, um, the open back, okay? So right here, and I hope you can see, all that padding on this back strap that's gonna go around the foot, it's gonna hug that heel, and of course, it's really that really classic look of, you know what, an op um, closed sandal, but yet open, because obviously you can see the, the breathability, you have that really nice butt stitch that, that brings it to life, and that's something new made in Turkey. My next style is Edvard. So really the previous style I just showed you, Laredo, came from the success of Edvard. Ranked number 10, I'm sure you can see why. Again, made in Turkey. So the difference is here, Edvard now has that closed back. But again, you have that padding that goes right around 
And of course, you know, wouldn't be awesome if we didn't add in some adjustability for the comfort. It is hook and loop. I want to open it so you can take a look how it is. And of course, leather lined um, right where you can see it. And take a look, notice of the toe shape. And again, just some really interesting detailing where it's open but yet closed. Because we also know, just you know what, just like a lady, we also know that um, he doesn't want to always have an open toe sandal. There's my other color of my brown. I just didn't have the sample it's a really nice rich brown now I'm going to move to the next style and this is Enzo so Enzo here he is and I talk about construction so now this is just a little bit of a different construction where you have that stitching all the way around the welting and that again brings that great flexibility and you can see again I point out the toe shape to you it's twin gore easy on and off and as you can see with really all of our styles I point it out every time but you can see that padding right around the heel and this lining here this is textile so it's going to feel really soft against the skin and not only that but behind it we put on um, a foam um, you know some foam cushioning I'll call it so again it's just going to really bring you all that great comfort so that's my style Enzo I'm just laughing because as I go through the styles there's so many fellas names that I actually know so I could really you know relate the shoe to someone I know in my life style Arthur I don't know an Arthur but maybe one of you do so this is style Arthur and Arthur is made in Turkey and again classic lace up take a look at the toe shape a little bit more um, not so rounded but just a little bit more wider because we want to make sure that he can um, have that wider fit so he is comfortable again it's just really high quality nice leather and the in um, the interior is that textile so now I'm on my next style. Again, I'm still in Turkey, and this is Dairo. And just take, check him out. I was talking about sandals earlier, and yes, this is open toe, but I want, I'm gonna take this brown, because I wanna show you, look at this. So this is hook and loop, and I want you to see all inside. So basically, you can see the interior. Take notice of the lining, how nice and soft it is. You have that leather insole, and talk about adjustability, there you go. And again, look at, take notice of the back strap. We put padding, just like on the other styles, and look at the outsole really kind of cool, kind of rugged, giving it that really cool look so you can feel um, nice and easy and classic. So now I have another new style. This is style Aspen. And you know what, we talked about what? Lorado and Edvard, and this is along the same line. So this is made in Turkey. This is something new. And what's so fabulous about him is, again, closed back has that little bit of that back um, strap look because you have some open perforations and just take notice here of number one the toe shape as I always call out but look at the breadth of colors that we did so we're really excited about him you have a black you have a nice darker brown a little bit more of a medium cognac brown and then this Bordeaux and before I move on I want you to see the outsole so check him out he comes up a little bit more in the back it's that stitch construction I'm sure you can see the stitching here following my hand really nice and of course I'm talking about all the other features but yes you have your hook and loop right there so just a really cool again a classic style a classic sandal you know I'm a little impartial because I'm coming to you live from Florida and of course we wear sandals all year round and I do see a lot of um, gentlemen wearing sandals so that's a really kind of cool year round Niccolo and you can see ranked number three and take a look you can see see why. So number one, I was just talking about that cool stitch construction and he is made in Turkey. You can see that stitch construction. That's what Turkey is known for. Of course, here we go. Removable insole, really nice. The leather here, again, it's high quality. It is pebbled, giving it that really nice rich look. And then his design elements, we just added this, um, this I'm going to call it almost that asymmetrical, really cool butt stitch that goes right around. And of course, there's your twin, uh, your twin elastic, your twin B Gore and this is Niccolo. Take notice of him because he is ranked number three. Okay, so next I am going to my sandal. So you can see all of our classic styles. I'm gonna get into sandals and these sandals of course are classic as well. Still made in Turkey. So what's great here is this is Ozzy, and um, we all know an Ozzy, I'm sure. And as you can see, super, super lightweight. I hope you can see it. It is that stitch construction, so you do have that great um, footbed. And what I really wanted to say was I have 
a double double band with adjustability. Of course, it's the buckles, but really, and you know what? I'm just gonna take one quick second because I do want to open this for you because I want you to see when I talk about a footbed. Can you see right here? This is the arch support, has that breathability, and again, it's that great, great construction. So just something classic for the men, and that is Style Ozzy. Along that same line, because he needs a brother, and this is Sparrow. Same exact construction, everything, but now he has a back strap. So there's your adjustability here and a third point of adjustability bringing in that buckle for the back strap I like so very much how when we do the black here it almost has that gray charcoal color um, footbed to really kind of um, make sure that it all kind of works together we're all about that something that is new and you're gonna see this next group that I show you in sandals. Now this is a new, brand new construction that we're introducing. We've had success with this construction before and here we're happy to bring it to you. And really what I want to point out is, I want to point out this really great footbed that's inside. It has right here that little bit um, for the sulcus. You can see right here for the heel. It's all about that flexibility. I hope you can see here where my finger is. All that great padding. So now you know you have that great padding. And then look at the bottom, right? The coolness here is that it almost has, has that welt look because these uppers are slotted right in. And what that does is that's going to bring all that durability and the comfort to you and you also have a little bit of the massage um, bumps in here to also make you feel good so that's the construction that we're introducing we're super excited about him and again a classic stand sandal it's a slide so when I see these you know what there's nothing wrong with wearing these in the house these can be inside as you will and then of course we just put a little interest in here which is a little bit I'm gonna call it the interlacing little accents there so Ben black and brown same construction I just described, made in Turkey. He is new and he is Jeff. So all we did for Jeff is we put a back strap here and then we just took a little bit different play on the upper where it's a pebbled leather. And of course you can see right now, oh, I'm gonna say one, two on this side and right here you can see those, um, the perforations and just look at the interest that the upper has, right? Has a little bit of the pin dots. I'm just looking here, it is lined so they don't go all the way through. And again, it's just really great looking nice sandal. So now I have another new sandal made in Turkey and this is Freeman. That same type of construction. It is that molded footbed. A little different construction but along the same lines and check it out. I mean that is really lightweight. That is really flexible and when we talk about sandals just very classic. So it's a two band. Take notice of the width here making sure that it covers and keeps the foot in all the toes and then we put the little bit of the wider strap here right where he needs it so it stays on the foot and you can see this is an adjustment adjustable functioning buckle here and of course looks like a nice little fashion element and then we have this really nice um this back strap making sure that it stays on the foot and then lastly Rojo he is made in Italy so we have a combination of Turkey and Italy how great is that that's European comfort for you and this is Rojo he's been with us for some time and you can see again just a really classic just a nice wide one band and again I look at this as indoor outdoor so keep that in mind and you can see the great price points I do want to point that out especially on that last collection of course throughout all of our men's collection but I want to point that out take notice of the great value it brings because that's something else that we stand for now I did announce in the beginning that we're going to talk about real life collection for men um, for spring and we you know um, I hope you all know that we introduced the real life for fall so um, real life is a really great great um, has a great story to it not just that it just brings great comfort and before I get into the styling I'm just going to tell you a little bit more about the real life so number one and we have this in our lady collection as well so number one it's all about the um, the comfort that it brings right and how does it work so it works that you have the um, the cylinders right in here you have your primary and your um, other cylinders right around that is really nice for your heel support these are all vegan friendly sustainable and that's really important to us here um, you know at spring step but I'm sure it's also very important to you and the materials that we use here are super high quality they are they feel 
feels so great and that's what brings comfort. We also make sure that it has that, we talk about our European last, that it has that extra room for you, that it is lightweight and of course that it's durable and looking great. So what we did is you're gonna see that we're carrying styles as annuals that we originally introduced in the fall and here's Hoover and Hoover is one of them. So Hoover is new. This is new for spring and I'm gonna get right into the styling. And again, as you can see, all that great padding, the great looks, twin gore, and you know what? We're adding that fashion really cool element by adding the stripes. I wanna just take out the tan for a second because you can see the gray inside, which is that blue color. And of course, all the little nice details all the way to the back. And I do wanna point out, so you can see it on your screen, this here outsole is a beige color with the gum bottom. It is not an exact pure white. Your black has a gray with the black. And then of course, your navy is a nice, um, more of a white. So that is a nice new style and that is our real life. And then the next style is Norman. Norman, I'm just missing the sample, but you can see him on the screen. And Norman is a carryover that we had very, you know what, I'm just gonna call it a really great like athletic look, that smart, street smart look. And you can see the great colorations on that. I love the blue especially because it brings in the different tones of the brown. And of course you have your, um, your brown there and you can see the nice little toe character that that outsole brings. So that's Style Norman. And then the next style within the collection is Raymond. And um, I would say a joke right now about everyone loves Raymond, but here you go. Here's our Raymond. And again, we talk about vegan friendly materials, right? So what does that mean? It means that they are man-made. And look at how I just want to point out, look at the burnishing. When I talk about high quality, hand done, hand burnished, look at the way it is. It has such great texture. It brings everything really to life. Look at the combination of the materials. It is really kind of cool. I want you to just to see, you could visually see it as I turn him all the way around. And then here, here's our little design element. We could have made a matching lace, but yeah, that's typical. But instead we brought this little contrast darker lace to kind of give him that little extra pop. And here's Raymond, and I want you to see that outsole there. I want you to see the black, what the black looks like. Again, bringing in that gray color outsole with that black right on the bottom, just to give him that really cool design element. So that's our Raymond. The next style here is Reagan. And again, these were in fall. So staying with the Relife, and really, uh, you know, I hope you can see here, because I showed you the cylinder on the bottom, but I want you to see it inside here. So really that's showing you that it's all throughout. That's what brings you the comfort. Take a look at this outsole, really kind of cool. You know, again, it's this special TPR outsole, but it has texture to it. It has that really cool blue line, and that's what it's about. It's about, of course, great styling. It is. It has a pebble finish. He has a pebble finish. And of course, I just want you to see the black so you can see these design elements. Check out here, it has that more of that, um, you know, that man-made suede look right here in the back. And right here, my last comment is, it has this almost this textile look around here. And of course, inside, boy, I wish you can feel how soft it is. It's this really nice textile with, I call it that foam underneath for all that comfort. And that style, Reagan. And then my next style here is Griffin, and he is new. And I hope you can see um, the great coolness about him just visually where you know look at all the details I can talk about um, two-tone laces take a look at the blue I like how we have that brown accent in here with that striping I love the construction I want you to see the bottom of it and I also want you to take notice again I'm all about that toe shape there and I'm going to show you this bottom so you can see actually that gum outsole and take a look and I always talk about the traction because that's what it's about too and remember vegan friendly so when you're in your store level we can just set you can set up we have some nice POPs um, and you could make a really nice story because it's important to us and I know that it's really important to others to be vegan friendly especially with all the consciousness of our environment going on so 
Next dial is Hazen and he is new. And you can see as I was talking with you, I'm actually removing this insole. This is a wow to me. So let me walk you just quick through it. So first and foremost, okay, we have, I talk about the cylinder, but we do, even though it's a removable insole, we're still bringing that technology right here and you can see my finger. And then I also wanna point out, look at how this is wrapped around right so your edges are all covered look at the hook and loop right all that toe area all across the heel it's going to make sure that it's in there and i don't know if you can see on your screen but i'm just going to shout out that not only is it removable but it's also washable keeping this clean keeping this washed is something of course that is um, something that's healthy for your feet so that's another great feature and then when you look at the style right i'm just going to leave it out for a minute so you can see you know again it's all about that great flexibility check out the cool outsole it has almost that little razor tooth to it again just bringing in that design element and then take a look at the upper and boy i wish you can just see and feel in here look at this it is padded it feels so great all across the skin and when we talk about sustainability a lot of these styles the the materials that are used for the footbeds and for the linings they are actually made from recycled water bottles so you know it's a really great thing for all of us and for our, our environment and then of course you know you can see the great um, I want to say design elements to it so it's a really soft um, a really soft sandal I know I'm kind of going on you can see I'm passionate about it but I want to make sure that you know and understand the whole story behind so now I have one last style we're almost there we one and this is Grady so Grady has that same just like the last style I showed you that same removable insole and again I want you to take a look and even here so you know what I have a removable insole but check it out we actually finish it here so it has that really nice finished look and I just want you to see we have a point of adjustability here of course it's this really nice hook and loop it's this really nice hook and loop here where you have that really cool d-ring so now this opens and then this top strap I just want to take a second to explain this so now the top strap of course it's hook and loop it's a d-ring but right here this is a prototype in my hand but this top strap although it doesn't open like this strap it does have stretch it will have stretch and that is specifically designed to make sure that it holds the foot because we're very careful when we do design and engineer our shoes to make sure that um, it's stretch and all where you need it but also to make sure that it holds the foot so this does stretch although it doesn't open all the way and take notice of the black take notice of that really cool gray looking um, footbed and again they're washable and um, removable so that is all the men's styles that I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed the presentation. I hope, I'm sure you saw things that you liked. And um, thank you so much for spending time with us. We're so happy that you joined us. So i just like to say thanks again, and um, we'll see you next time. And let us know if you have any questions. Of course, you can contact your sales rep. Thank you very much, everyone. Have a good day. Bye-bye.